What up, Lucarian? This is Multimeter Lucario, and today we're going to, I'm going to be showing you how you can get Windows 10 for free still if you're on Windows 7 or Windows 8.1. So we're going to go into Microsoft Edge. Well, this is different. Well, uh, but in this case, for you guys, it'd be either Google Chrome, Mozilla Firefox, Opera, or Internet Explorer. And we're going to Type in Windows 10 Assistive Upgrade. Yeah. Yes, that, yes, that means you can still get Windows 10 for free with assistive technologies. I'm pretty sure a lot of people would use this, this loophole. And that's it. And if you if you or someone you know uses assistive technologies, tell them about this, and I'll put a link to the, to the website in the description. Now, for those XP and Vista users who need to upgrade to Windows 10, you're not going to be doing an upgrade. You need to do a clean install. As we type in Windows 10 ISO, I'm going to go click here. Oh, I need to sign in. As you can see here, you can if you are on the regular Windows 10, then you can go to here, which is the update now. Now we're looking to install Windows on your PC. Well, you'll download the tool now and save the media, save and run the media creation tool file. To your to your computer. Now we're gonna select run. Yes, right there. It's gonna take. Oh well, never mind. It says getting a few things ready. Yes. You have to please read this licensing terms. Thoroughly, I do not recommend skipping this. If you need to, you definitely need to see this. And as we wait a while for to get off this loading screen, you can select create installation media for another PC. No, we're not going to be using a recommended option. I'd recommend going for both. 32-bit and 64-bit, you know, opt for like a universal style. Just select ISO in this case, but I do recommend using a USB. Just select next. And then save it to de whichever section you want in your file explorer. And it will and we'll download the ISO file. I'm not going to make you guys wait for the entire process. So I'm going to make a cut back. And I'll make a cut here and come back when I'm ready to go. Also, uh, one more thing. This will take a, may, this may or may not take an hour. It may take, it may take even more if you have, if you have a lot of stuff on your computer. You're trying to squeeze this into your memory. And also, if you or someone you know needs help or advice with switching to Windows 10, contact or support at Nineteen. Yeah, just forget it. Oh, and I, I want to give a. A shout out to Breakage. Go subscribe to him, cause he made this video, which he made a video like this, which I got inspired by. So it got me in the mood to do my own. So yeah, go subscribe to him. Okay, so so the 
downloading process is at 34%. This may take a while depending on your computer's speed and its memory. If you were if you or someone you know needs help or advice with switching to Windows 10, go go to the Windows 10 help page, which I will show which I will show you right here. So let me type in Windows support. Let's go to the Windows site. And then let's go to here. Here we are, the Windows help page. And then boom, boom, there we go. All links to this will be in the description below. So no need to contact a number, you can just find you can just find it right in here. I want one more announcement. As of as of December thirty first at nine p.m., I will no longer be. I will turn off my video support for for Samsung Galaxy S four Minis and lower. However, Lenovo tablets are not affected. I will be posting a video about that on on that day. So be prepared and upgrade to to iOS, Windows Mobile, or or digital Android, which means like phones like Google Pixel, stuff like that. Okay, so we're more than halfway there, done, done with the download process, so we need to go to verify the download, as well as creating the installation media. I have no idea why it's been taking that long, but, meh, meh. Okay, so it's, it finished the downloading process and now it's verifying the download. So you're going to need to wait a little while longer for it to create the, the installation media. And make another cut right here and I'll come back when I'm ready to go. Now it's creating the Windows 10 installation media. Only 9% more to go. Alright, so the, the ISO is finished downloading and setup is cleaning up before it closes. Alright, so what you're going to need to do, it, to do next is like, is get a D, is get a DVD, put it in the DVD drive or the DVD drive attachment that you plugged into your laptop. And then then transfer the ISO files to the disk and then burn them. And no, I do not mean burn like fire burn. None of that. I'm I mean like writing the data onto the disk burn. Now for now for assistive technology users this is going to be this is going to be easier. Oh, okay, this may take a while. I'll get to the page. I'll get to the page. Okay, so I got the page. So what you're gonna do for assistive technologies? It's, it's um, click on the button that says upgrade now, and then click save. And then click run. Now this won't work because considering that I, I already have Windows 10. So you will have to follow the on-screen prompts that you'll have to, you have to follow the on-screen prompts, but when on Windows 7, 8, or 8.1, you you'll have to follow the on-screen prompts. And this will not say thank you for updating to the latest version of Windows 10. No. So anyway guys, 
This is how you can get Windows 10 for free uh, in the dis in December 2016. I just if you do like this video, hit the like button, and if you're new to my channel, subscribe to become an official Lucario Knight. Also, you can follow me on Facebook as Multimedia Lucario, and on Amiiverse as Lucario Mario 448. Not only that, you can buy merch from my shop at kobanamarnysmg4.wixsite.com slash slash Multimedia Lucario slash shop. And that's pretty much it. And until next time, peace out, Lucari Knights.